What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Crim Dollar Crim, Crim Dollar Holla. Coming back at you from Memphis, Tennessee. We out here in Memphis, Tennessee tonight. Uh, tomorrow we will be in Nashville, Tennessee. And I'm coming to you to obviously give you the breakdown on today's game. Now, unfortunately, we lost. It was one of those games where we pretty much uh, a challenge to play. And again, even with challenging the pass interference, even though it was clear that the the corner was turned, he played the ball, he damn nearly even had an interception. And even though we threw the flag, we still couldn't get the call overturned. But it is what it is. We implemented the rule. We try to change the game, make it as fair as possible. But it seems like the league doesn't want to come, doesn't want to uh, go with it. So they're, they're you got their. Um, the refs still doing what they want to do. Um, before I keep I keep going, I wanted to ask if you could please hit that like and subscribe, and don't forget that at the end of the video to put your comment in there, negative, positive. It doesn't matter. So, it, what it, everything you gotta say is gonna help. Football season is here. I expect a lot of trash talking. I expect a lot of people to even get personal because it's already happening. But it's all good. I, you know me. You can't hurt me with your words. You know what I'm saying? I'm up, I'm way above that. Now you will piss me off and get me mad, and that'll be a whole other game. But as far as um, I, how you call it, as far as actually pissing me off, no, nah, it's all good. Y'all can talk all you want. You see how I'm living, so it's all good. Big shout out to my homegirl Pam and the Camel Toe Squad. Camel Toe, my brother, now we appreciate you for all the shout out. Big shout out to Nas and all your videos, brother. I seen you doing good. Thank you for that shout out on your video. I appreciate you showing me love on your on your channel. Also want to say a shout out to my boy Lou G out in New York City. What's up, my boy Lou? Where you at? Where you at? And what's up, my uh, uh, to my boy Preston down in Miami, Florida. What's up, Papi? I'll be down there in about three weeks. I'll let your boy. And then uh, I have to say a big shout out to my girl Maria in California. What's up, ma? Your boy's gonna be there and in two months. I'm going back up there to Cali. Holla at you. Holla, holla at your boy. Getting back to the video. You know what it is. It, we lost the game. It's all good. Uh, the one thing that I really wanted to see was these young rookies come out. Now, Jordan Humphrey, I told you guys that Jordan Humphrey was a beast. I told you guys, if you go back to a couple of my videos that I, when I was showing you the videos of uh, the, uh, the draft picks, Jordan Humphrey, I've been watching him since he was playing for uh, Texas State. This Longhorn motherfucker can catch anything. All right, he's got the arms, he's got strength. He is six four. He's a tall, lengthy motherfucker. So you put him at the slot today, he proves that he can handle that, and he is also a wide out receiver. So he can play any wide any wide receiver position. He has that talent. This is the player that that, that our Saints have been very very quiet about. about. All right, everybody knows about Quincy because everybody knows that Quincy is a loud player. He's a player that everybody's going to know when he's around. So Quincy's hard to keep away. But Humphrey, Jordan, we kept him on the side and said, look, don't put him out there until it's time to put him out there. Everybody's been talking about the fact that we don't have no other receivers. And yet yesterday, Taysom Hill and, and Teddy Bridgewater were fucking pulling on them down, boom, 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 all day long. Now you have more receivers drop more balls than they actually, uh, uh, that I actually expected for them to. But this is the first preseason game. You know, all the nerves and all that is going to be rattled. And it, 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 don't, don't, if your team lost today, don't be mad. This is preseason. Okay, so if you if you notice that in the league last year, a lot of a lot of teams that were losing in the first couple of quarters came back and won. Or I mean, you have the Patriots and and, and, and fucking Falcons. That is the no pri primary number one example of coming back and winning uh, when the Patriots beat the Falcons in the Super Bowl. So it's something that you can't take away. You can't you can't say well they just played they played the first quarter and I mess with a lot of. Philadelphia Eagle fans and I tell them, look, they'll say you, oh, it doesn't matter this that, because the t Eagles were the only team man, that really got blown out. They didn't lose; they got blown away, and um, a lot of people didn't expect that. A lot of people didn't expect for us to lose. We we didn't get blown away, but we had to we had the game 
we had the game won pretty much, but you know, through, after that one fumble and and pretty much coughed up the ball and, and gave them that that uh, that pick six, uh, it, it it pretty much it, it changed the whole momentum of the game right there, and, and unfortunately we lost. But like I said, don't not take it to the heart. This is just the preseason. We got three more preseason games, and then after that, you can take it to the heart. But you ain't got to worry about it because you got the number one quarterback of the league, Drew Brees. You got Alvin Kamara. You got T uh, Thomas. And now, on the side of 10 again, you're going to have Jordan Humphrey. I guarantee you that boy's going to make a squad. If Jordan Humphrey don't make the squad, I swear. I'm going to go to the New York Superdome and I'll throw some at Sean's ass. Like, what the fuck are you doing? Jordan Humphrey has to be on this team. We did, we did draft him. So let's see what's going to happen. So... Um, and aside of that, I gotta say I was pretty surprised with Daniel Jones from the from the Giants, and I know my boy out there from uh, from the AC gonna love this. Your boy from the Giants looked pretty impeccable, pretty good for that one drive. He did he looked pretty good with a touchdown. So hey, so the Giants got something to, something to cheer for. Yeah, Odell got fucked up on that one, but. You got a chance now with Chance, with uh, Daniel, uh, with Chase Daniel, Daniel Jones, something like whatever the fuck his name is. I know it's something Daniel, so uh, it's Jones, so it's Daniel Jones, I guess. So um, you know, like I said, it's a, he was he did pretty good. Um, it's preseason. Let's see how he does the rest of the year. Uh, and um, like I said, tune in to tune into the next uh, uh, video. Uh, we're gonna do evaluate the team a little bit further. But this was I wanted to give my first opinion of what was going on out there and what I and what I think about the what the game was, uh, how was the game played. But uh, pretty good for a preseason game. I'm very excited for the season. It's your boy Creme de la Creme, Creme de la Hala, coming at you straight out of Memphis, Tennessee. Yes, indeed. Tomorrow we'll have some barbecue Memphis style. Holla at your boy. One love.